If you're anything like me, you're probably unimpressed with the new agent mode in ChatGPT's browser, um, Atlas. So there's an agent mode which basically allows ChatGPT to take over your computer, take over your browser and search around looking for things. And there's some pretty cool uses for it. You can book tickets. Um, you can actually get it to automate on Twitter, for example, and post for you. So you can do uh, some kind of fun little tasks. However, it is extremely slow. It feels like, and I don't want to be ageist here, but it sounds, it feels a bit like when you are helping somebody who's maybe a little bit older and they don't necessarily know how to use a piece of software and you're standing behind their shoulder saying, okay, move the cursor up there, now click on that button, now move over to the right. It is that kind of speed, which is frankly just absolutely frustrating. However, we must remember that this is an early iteration. So some people are saying, we'll never use this. It's just faster to do it myself. They're missing the point. The idea with agents is one, they're gonna get faster, but also two, we're gonna be able to set up parallel agents. So instead of me going to one website and doing some research, I'll be able to send 20 versions of myself off to different websites in order to do different actions. That is what a lot of the critics are missing right now. And we are early days, but that's where we're heading.